What's up everyone, welcome to Inside Take and I'm Subod. Nowadays many people have various Android devices and many of them don't know real power of Android operating system. Today I'm going to show you some apps and modules that can unlock real power of Android device. I'm using Android phone one and a half year and I spend minimum 6 hours of a day on my Android device. I found some great apps can change your whole experience with your phone. Before we start, I want to clear one thing. I am very hardcore super user of Android. So some people can be found some app not useful for them because they are not that much android addicted. If any app is missing from the list so you can comment the app name I will test and add to the description of this video. I don't want to waste your time so let's move to the how to use android like a boss. Before we start, we need rooted Android device which is 4.1 or above. First take a look of the apps which don't need root access. First app is Textra. Textra is a great app for alternative to your boring stock Android messaging app. Textra comes with material design which looks cool and user interface is definitely easy and useful. Also Textra have their own heads up notification which looks damn awesome and easy to access new text messages. Next app is my favorite alternative for YouTube app. App name is Viral. Everyone know Google YouTube app stopped buffering after you exit app but Viral still buffer your video in background. Also Viral have pop up window function which is very helpful in multitasking. Also Viral offers you 144 resolution which is minimum and easy to buffer in slow internet. Next app is ES File Manager which is the best file manager available on Play Store in my opinion. ES File Explorer comes with many functions. You can open two or more folders at the same time same as your desktop. ES File Explorer have many features like analyze your SD card, system app and hide or unhide files. No doubt ES File Explorer is 100 times better than stock Android File Explorer. You guys must try this app in my opinion. Next app is ADM, means Android Download Manager, which helps to download files from internet. ADM is same as IBM, Internet Download Manager in our desktop. Now let's move to the root required apps. If you don't know about root, you can google it, there are lots of videos which explaining what is root. First app is Softkey Enabler. So people say you already have capacitive buttons, so why on screen button? So I found on screen buttons are more easy to use, also you can customize them. I personally like on screen button, it's upon you what you like. This app helps to get on screen button on your normal Android device. Next app is Wiper for Android. Wiper for Android can change your whole experience of listening music on your phone. This app is simply like equalizer app but more advanced option. My personal experience with this app is totally awesome. Download link of this app is in description you can check it out later on. Next app is Titanium Backup. Titanium Backup is the best app to backup your apps and data, especially time of flashing a new ROM. Titanium Backup is the most easiest backup app I ever seen. Just one click can backup all the apps and one click can restore all the apps. It's really awesome. With Titanium Backup, you're never going to lose your data again. Now let's move to the Expose module which is my favorite and most exciting part of this video. Expose module allows to change and customize your phone deeply with easy user interface. If you don't know about Expose installer and Expose modules then just go to google and google it. There are lots of videos which explain what is Expose installer. So first module is Nexus Navbar which allows you to customize on screen buttons very easily. There are lots of types of navigation bar in this app. You can choose what you like. Next module is Tinted Status Bar. This module is my one of the favorite modules. It gives feel like Android 5.0 lollipop status bar. Status bar color change with app color looks damn cool and very awesome. Still this module in beta testing so some apps not working with it. Let it be this app is cool. 
Next module is HK Theme Manager, which helps you to apply theme on your Android. Synogen Mod ROMs have their own theme engine. It's same as like that. Now I am on Android L theme and it looks pretty cool and real Android app. HK Theme Manager only works with stock Android user interface. Next module is Gravity Box, which is my most favorite and all-in-one module which helps to customize all parts of Android device. You can customize lock screen, status bar, navigation bar, transfer C, power tweaks, display and many more. Gravity Box is the must download export module. Gravity Box have lots of options, you can check it out by yourself, for example, this is my blur lock screen. It looks very cool and damn awesome. Next module is Greenify. Greenify actually available on Play Store also, but you can connect to Expose module to work perfectly with your phone. Greenify helps to manage your RAM. It helps to automatically force close apps selected by you. Greenify saves more battery and RAM usage. That's it. This is my list of favorite apps and exposed modules and some rooted apps which can make you boss of your phone. If you guys found this video helpful, then go ahead and click on like button. Also, don't forget to subscribe to the channel because more videos like this are coming soon in action. Also, you can comment your questions below. I will try to answer some of them. Android Lollipop release is also very close and I have Android One device which is a one of the first device which will get Android L update. So stay tuned for more videos, like us on every page, also follow me on Instagram, I'm there always for you. I will catch you guys in the next one very soon. Thank you.